After 31st Southeast Asian Games runner-up Team Vietnam dominated Team Philippines, a former SEA Games champion and national team volleyball spoke her mind on matters players and fans should consider for the 2022 Asian Women's Volleyball Cup. Chaos and Sean tells us more. 31st Southeast Asian Games runner-up team of Vietnam swept off the Philippine women's volleyball team in three sets at the 2022 Asian Women's Volleyball Cup held at the Phil Sports Arena Pasig City. With a score of 25-19, 25-17, and 31-29, the depleted lineup of Creamline Coal Smashers failed to recover with the absence of players like Risa Sato, Gia de Guzman, and Eliza Valdez, who was sidelined due to dengue. Thiethan Thuy Tran listed 20 points with 17 spikes, 1 block, and 2 aces, enough to be named player of the game. For Philippine National Volleyball Federation and National Team Commission member Rosemarie Prochina, consistency could be the biggest defense of the squad given the current situation. Given siguro, magbabigyan lang ng pagkakataon ang, ang PNBF na makapagbuo ng team with the help of the club teams and the schools Maging maganda ulit ang ating national team. The former national volleyball and member of the 1993 SEA Games Women's Volleyball Team champion also commented on the clamor of fans over social media who got disappointed with the national team and PNBF. Yung sisihan, siguro ngayon dapat nila imulat na ito, ito yung time na magtutulungan tayo which is hindi mo sisisihin yung asosasyon, Siguro yung ano lang eh, communication. In their match against a five-time champion China on Tuesday night at 7, there is the possibility that the national squad would get in prize setter Gia de Guzman as Kerman gives a sneak preview of its training on Monday. K. Asuncion for The Nation.